Howdy, 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 everybody. This is Gomer the Ranting Thespian, and welcome back to Mega Man X. The last time we took on Spark Mandrill and Armored Armadillo, but now we'll start with Launch Octopus. And I am so glad I will not ever have to revisit this stage. The water stage. Water stages are alright, but it's just, he's, he's like all these levels, they're big. Um, relatively big. Although I seem to be going through them at a decent clip, so make of that what you will. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it's mostly it's mostly going to be underwater. And once we get once we get through this segment, at least. By the way, let's check out the sub tanks. I've already filled up like what two of them already. Just working on the third. Thank you, armored armadillo stage. Now, if you want, you can do you can you can go down there carefully and and just work you know work through careful you know. I'm being reckless, is what I'm trying to get at here. And while I did not die, I did get I did get a face full of seahorse. So yeah, take that as you will. And oh, we all live in a yellow submarine, yellow submarine, yellow submarine. Ah, uh, come on, thank you. Bye. Oh uh, no. Okay. Ah. Uh. Yeah, it's hard to... Sometimes it's hard to see with the frame rate here. Um, again, uh, as I mentioned in the last video, I'm doing all of these, like, in one sitting. So, if you guys have comments, like, throughout the... Uh, come on, really? Here, fuck off. And I get a 1-up, too, so... Okay. Um, anyway. Uh, frame rate, right. So, if you guys are seeing some of the same issues I am... Um, yeah, that's probably going to be a problem for the rest of the series, because I'm doing all these in one go. <laughs> so, uh, but it'll be nice to know for the next series, right? And eat me! Eat me, fishy. Eat me good. Oh, this one. Oh, you. Oh, you little. Oh, you motherf... Oh. Nope. Come on. Thank you. Ah! Oh shit. Okay, come on. Come on, stay in the air, stay in the air. Eight, eight, no. no! No! You! 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 That is Gomerish for. What the fuck, dude? Uh huh? Ah, <sighs> wow. Okay. That was that 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 happened. Um, now one of these takes me up to oh wrong side. It's over here. Okay, come on. There we go. Oh no, that's in the no, that's not it because while well, there is something there and it's useful, it only has something like a heart tank or or things like that. In the uh, Game Boy Color version, uh, I think it's extreme too. So yeah, duh, forgot all about that. But I did not forget about this, nor did I forget about Dre. E come on, die, 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 and thank you, goodbye. Destroy those spikes for me. So what you know, uh, this area has not only one type of mini boss, but two. Uh, technically three, I guess the sub counts. But then you got this guy. We'll see him again later. And by the way, if you're wondering how I'm going to avoid those spikes without being able to see them, note those green columns back there in the background. They will always line up with a platform. Yep. Hey, buddy. How you doing? X, how are you heavy breathing underwater? Even even for, even for a robot, that's weird. Hmm. And again, you know, maybe X just has a thing that keeps him from, you know, that allows him to draw in oxygen and power. Which, why would a robot need oxygen? Hmm. 
I don't know. But I don't know those answers, but I know this answer. This answer is this mother's gonna die. I said this mother's gonna die. Script? What script? There we go. And it good thing about those, they drop lots of power-ups. So anyway, I get a heart. Yay! By the way, fun thing about... Eh, where is it at? <laughs> the fire... The, the, the fire wave does not work underwater. Nice touch. Nice touch. Uh, okay. So, not far along. We will also have this guy again. Come on up, buddy. Come on up! You're the next contestant on Die, Die, Die. Ow. Hey, you shooting me in the back of the head! Well, you're trying to kill me, aren't you? No, I'm just walking around, running around trying to get back. Yeah, well... Well, the game won't let me go on until you die. So... You gotta die. And there we go. Yay! Boom. Ah. Oh, I almost forgot. I was about to be ready to go, and I was like, oh, wait, I got these guys. Oops. Eh, thank you. <laughs> All right. Launch Octopus. This will be fun. Leaps around, throws missiles, throws fish at you. Literal fish. Okay, literal robo fish, but still. You're going down. You're going down. No, 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 no. Oh, really? Wow. Asshole. That's what you get. No. Seriously? Come here. You mother. Ooh, rebound shot. <laughs> oh, fuck off, octopus. And again, you could use Boomer Kawanger's weapon to cut off his tentacles. I might do that in the rematch, but... <laughs> But in fact, I think it's when you pl when you fight against him in Mega Man Extreme 2, you have um, Neon Tiger's uh, weapon, which in that game is the Ray Claw. You cut it right up. In fact, that's I think that is his actual weakness. Maybe. No, it's not his actual weakness. His actual weakness is the Tri-Thunder in that one. But, oh well, he's gone. So, speaking of Boomer Coinger, I've brought him up. Let's go. Now, this is going to be a stage we will have to revisit later. <sighs> At least I think we will. I think there's a trick to where we don't have to, but if I can pull it off within one or two shots, I will, but... But... But I'm, I'm just... Just in case, we'll, we'll likely have to... Ow! Dick. We will likely... Ow! Motherfucker, come here. Yeah. Oh. Uh. You know, I am so glad. See, one of the good things about OBS, ow, it's not that, is they have a channel for like your computer background and such. You know, like your background noise and all of that. And you can turn that channel off. And, and so those noises don't come in. So like if you have like, you know, your computer is particularly noisy with notifications or what have you, no problem. Uh, you can even listen to music or podcasts while you're recording these things. I'm not doing that this day because I'm concentrating on talking to you guys. But, uh, oh, and, oh yeah. I get to do this, maybe. There we go. Whoa, I have a barrier. Hard to see because of the frame rate, but I have it. There it is. <laughs> I'll see how far it'll take me. I think it destroys these little... Uh, yep. Little turrets in one go. 
Yeah. What about you guys? Yep. Several things in one go. You know, that's pretty good. <laughs> ah! Dick. Yeah, yeah, come on. You know, it's weird. This is this is basically the, the beetle stage. You got chameleon, you know, like little lizards. Things that would eat beetles climbing up and down the ladders. Then again, it could be a case of, hey, I'm a beetle, and 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 I, I have dominion over what would normally scare me as a beetle. And they're all they're all uh oh yeah, this. This fucking thing. So one way you could do this is somehow manipulate your uh, shotgun ice and do a dash off of that the other direction. That's not the way to do it. Because that fucking thing got in the way. Thank you. Ah! But I think you guys see the, the thing. I'm going to try again. Good old proper college try. Oh, wait. Duh. That did the same thing I did in um, uh, Spark Mandrill stage. Nope. Okay, you know what? Fuck it. I'm coming back later. I gotta add... I'm gonna need more meat to add to the... Uh, the uh, cleanup video anyway, so... Which should be coming up next, I think. Yeah. That'll be the video after this, so... Clean up video! Woo! Because the next one will be only one Maverick, because I've been doing two per thing, and... And the intro stage took up half of the Chill Penguin one, so... You know... Fuck you guys! You know, with a wall- with a wall jump set up, and your room set up like this, those platforms, well, they're probably just there to be annoying. Okay, Boomer Quanger. He's one of those teleporting kind of guys. Bet you he picked that up from Wily. Because uh, I think at this point it had been well established that Wily loves the little teleporting capsule tricks. Nope. You know, I remember, like, the Nintendo Power article for this when it was released. They were talking about Boomer Quanger, and they say, Grab the bull! Grab the bull by the horns, even though he's a beetle. Or, or some kind of... Ow! Oh! <laughs> wow! Gotcha! Oh, really? <laughs> oh, that was... That was... Brilliant. I don't think I could ever replicate that on my own. <laughs> Just... Yeah, that, I'm, I'm glad that was recorded. The Boomerang Cutter. So, fun fact about these. As long as you catch the one you send out, as long as it's uncharged, of course, you will never lose... You will never permanently lose that weapon energy. It'll, you'll get it back. The only, way, the only way it'll be permanent is if you do a charged one, or if one, like, runs into an enemy that doesn't outright destroy it, and thus destroying the projectile itself. Um, but I'll show all that off in the next video. So, uh, yeah, next one will be the last Maverick and a bit of cleanup. So, yeah, with that, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys are enjoying it. Take care, everybody, and until next time, this is Gomer, the Ranting Thespian, signing off.